गुड मॉर्निंग नाइन क्लास स्टूडेंट्स वी डिस्कसिंग द लेसन नाइन क्लास फर्स्ट चैप्टर द एंथ सो इन द लास्ट क्लास वी शॉल डिस्कस अबाउट द इंटरनल स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द एंथ एंड आल्सो वी डिस्कस अबाउट द एंथ इज मेड अप ऑफ थ्री लेयर्स फर्स्ट वन इज क्रस्ट सेकंड वन इज मेंटल एंड थर्ड वन इज Code. And we also discussed about the movements of the Earth, the Earth's rotation, the Earth's revolution. Okay. And in the last class, we shall discuss about a German meteorologist, Alfred Wagner. What? Alfred Wagner. So he introduced the theory, the continental drift. He introduced the theory what? The continental drift. So, according to the continental drift, the entire land, the whole land, is called Pangaea. What? Pangaea. So, due to the rotation of the plates, the Pangaea is divided into two parts. The Pangaea is divided into two parts. So, first one is Angara land, and second one is Gondwana land. And Angara land and Gondwana land separates a sea. That sea is called Tethys Sea. So all these are we are discussed in the last class part two. So in this class part three, we shall discuss about the latitudes. What latitudes? Okay. So on the this is a globe. The middle line of the earth is called zero degree latitude or equator. Okay. So latitudes. The horizontal lines on the globe are called latitudes. So these are the horizontal lines. These are what? Horizontal lines. The horizontal lines on the globe are called latitudes. So the middle line of the globe is called zero degree latitude or equator. Okay. So latitudes are come from the Latin word latitudo. Okay. So the latitudes come from the Latin word that is called what? Latitudo. So this means. Width. Okay, width. Width of the latitudes. So these lines shows the width of the map. These lines shows what the width of the map from zero degree to north pole. So this is north pole ninety degree. So this one south pole ninety degree. So from zero degree to north pole. 90 latitudes are there, and from zero degree to south pole, 90 latitudes are there. So total, how many latitudes are there? Total 180 latitudes are there. How many latitudes are there? 180 latitudes are there. And from zero degree to north pole, this is called northern hemisphere. From zero degree to north pole, this is the northern hemisphere, and from zero degree to south pole, this is the southern hemisphere. So, from zero degree to north pole, ninety latitudes are there, and from zero degree to south pole, or southern hemisphere, ninety latitudes are there. So, total one eighty latitudes are there. Okay, and Among all the latitudes, some important latitudes are there. What? Some important latitudes are there, and they are the special ones. The latitudes are the special ones. Okay. So the middle line of the globe is called zero degree latitude or equator. I have already told you. What? Equator. Okay. This one equator. 
so this one 23 half degree north latitude 23 half degree north latitude so this is called tropic of cancer tropic of cancer and next one is 66 half degree north latitude so this is called arctic circle and this is north pole 90 degrees so when you come to the south pole okay so this is 23 half degree south latitude this is called tropic of capricorn tropic of capricorn and this one 66 half degree south latitude so this is called antarctic circle what antarctic circle arctic circle antarctic circle and this is south pole 90 degree south so these are the important latitudes on the globe so once again i am repeating latitudes the horizontal lines on the globe are called latitudes the middle line of the globe is called 0 degree latitude or equator okay so latitudes come from the latin word latitude so this meaning is width this meaning is what width so these lines shows the width of the map these lines shows what the width of the map from 0 degree to north pole or northern hemisphere 90 latitudes are there and from 0 degree to south pole or southern hemisphere 90 latitudes are there so total latitudes 180 latitudes are there how many latitudes 180 latitudes are there so when you come to the all the latitudes so here some important latitudes are there or some special names are there okay the special names are first one is the middle line zero degree latitude is called equator 23 half degree north latitude this is called tropic of cancer 66 half degree north latitude this is called arctic circle so this one north pole 90 degree north so when you come to the southern hemisphere okay 23 half degree south latitude this is called tropic of capricorn 66 half degree south latitude this one called arctic circle and this one south pole 90 degree south okay so this is all about the latitude and we can discuss longitudes this is all about the latitudes okay so now we discuss the next topic longitudes what longitudes okay so this one Go. Okay. So, what are longitudes? So, the longitudes comes from the Latin word longitudo. Okay. The longitudes come from the Latin word longitudo. This means length. This means what? Length. It shows the length. Okay. So, this shows the length and height of the map. Okay. So, the vertical lines on the globe are called longitudes. The vertical lines. So, these are the vertical lines. Okay. The vertical lines on the globe are called what? Longitudes. Okay. The center straight line of the globe is called zero degree longitude. What? Zero degree longitude. 
so the zero degree longitude is also called Greenwich longitude and the Greenwich longitude is also called prime meridian what? prime meridian ok so this zero degree longitude passes near to the London in England the zero degree longitude that is passes near to the London that is in England. So from zero degree to eastward 180 longitudes are there and from zero degree to westward 180 longitudes are there. From zero degree to east this is called eastern hemisphere and from zero degree to west this is called western hemisphere. So from 0 degree to eastern hemisphere, 180 longitudes are there and from 0 degree to west, 180 longitudes are there. So total, how many longitudes are there? 360 longitudes are there. Total, how many longitudes are there? 360 longitudes are there. So I am already told you from 0 degree to eastward, 180 longitudes are there and from 0 degree to westward 180 longitudes are there from 0 degree to eastward this one called eastern hemisphere and from 0 degree to westward this is called western hemisphere so with the help of longitudes and latitudes ok with the help of latitudes and longitudes it will form a grid that is called what? grid so with the help of grid, we can locate the places easily on the globe. We can find out the time on the globe with the help of grid. Okay, this is all about the longitudes. So once again I am repeating. So the vertical lines on the globe are called longitudes. Okay, so the longitudes comes from the Latin word longitude word. So here, this means the length, okay, the length of the, the lines are called what? Length of the places, okay, and so these are the vertical lines on the globe, these are called longitudes, the center line of the globe is called zero degree longitude. So the zero degree longitude is also called Greenwich longitude and it is also called prime meridian. From 0 degree to east, this is called eastern hemisphere and from 0 degree to west, this is called western hemisphere. So from 0 degree to eastward, 180 longitudes are there and from 0 degree to westward, 180 longitudes are there. So total, 360 longitudes are there. And the globe, total, how many longitudes are there? 360 longitudes are there. Okay, so with the help of latitudes and longitudes, it will form the grid. Grid is nothing but, okay, the latitudes and longitudes is known as what? Grid. So with the help of grid, we can locate the places easily on the globe. And at the same time, we can find out the time also with the help of grid. Okay, so this is all about the longitudes. And the next topic is time zone. What? Time zone. The next topic is time zone. So, with the help of longitudes, we can find out the time on the globe. And the world, the entire world is divided into 24 time zones. The entire world is divided into how many time zones? 24 time zones. So, the international time zone is the 0 degree longitude or the Greenwich longitude or the prime meridian. Okay, all the countries must be follow the 0 degree longitude. Okay, so when you come to the Indian standard of time, 
Okay, the Indian standard of time, the Indian standard time is 82 degree half is longitude. 82 degree half minute is longitude is the Indian standard time. Okay, so the time difference between 0 degree longitude and Greenwich longitude to Indian standard time is 5 and half an hours. The Greenwich mean time and the Indian standard time. Okay, the time difference is 5 and half an hours and the Indian standard time that is 82 degree half inch east longitude that is passes near to the Alhava. Okay, the Alhava is located in the Uttar Pradesh. So, in this way, we can find out the time zone with the help of longitude. Okay, so this is all about the time zone. Students, once again carefully revise the lesson, go thoroughly textbooks and what you know the important points in your notebook, that one also you have to revise. Very soon we are conducting the online exam. So on that online exam, you have to be prepared. All the best. Thank you.